Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today we're going to be talking about some CMS page stuff, okay? Most specifically, I'm going to be showing you how to edit the About Us page. So if we come down here into the footer, you'll see this link about us. And if you were to click down this, you would see these three paragraphs, you know, some paint color, whatever. And you could be wondering um, where exactly this was coming from. Well, luckily, we have our uh, dashboard. And in our dashboard, we have a CMS and then pages. So if you click on pages, you'll see some of the pages that are here, including the 404 page, the privacy policy page, the home page and the home page with the two columns which is actually the one that's enabled you'll notice this one says disabled uh, enable cookies page uh, customer service page and about us so let's click on this uh, preview button right here on the side and you can see the actual page notice how this is just a preview it's opening up in a new window um, but it's not actually the same URL as this but okay let's click out of this so let's click this about us here it's going to take us to where we can edit so this is going to say all store views, its status is enabled. If we turn it off, it will not be showing up. This we can change the page's title, um, the URL key. See, like if we want to just say about hyphen us, this is now going to be the URL, which I think is a little bit better than whatever they had before. Okay, so now if we click content here in the far left, you'll see this content editor. This is the WYSIWYG editor. This is where we can change and completely edit any of that stuff. Um, if you click show hide editor right here you can see this is actually giving you access to the html itself notice how there's a uh, div class of call one call two call three you can just fill in what you want in between those and it's going to keep this three column set um, as long as you don't get rid of any of these classes all you know you could also just from here take this and edit this one paragraph at a time uh, if that's what you're interested in doing notice how if i click back here um, where was that? I typed hello, just like this. It's right here. So this actually kept in the columns. Um, you know, I'd probably feel more comfortable just editing the HTML myself. However, if you're a content editor, you don't know HTML, you can um, definitely use this content WYSIWYG editor. It's also quick for styling if you want to change something to a head header or something like that. Um, you can, you know, bold things, you can do all sorts of stuff. It also gives you the option of adding variables and um, these widgets. So we can insert a widget, but we don't actually have any widgets just yet. Let's see what happens if we even click that. Yeah, it's going to say, okay, do you want to insert a CMS page link, um, a static block, a category link? Pretty much you can insert any of these. You can add this recently compared products right here. And you can just say display five products in a compare products grid and we can click insert. And it's going to insert this code here that when this executes, uh, it's going to actually have those recently shown product, uh, products on this page. Uh, we'll actually leave this one even in here, even though it's a little ridiculous to be using this. Um, it's perfectly fine. You know, whatever. This is just a test site. Cool. So you can just get in here and change any of this text, uh, make it nice and perfect, however you want it. Um, and you'll notice I didn't do a ton here, whatever. Um, now, design, you can say this is one column. You can make sure it has a left uh, left uh, sidebar, right sidebar, or three columns if you'd like. We're going to leave this at one column because I sort of like this three column look. And uh, you can also give it a custom design that runs from a certain time to a certain time. I'm not going to bother. You can also give this metadata um, just, you know, so you, the page has metadata. Let's save this page and let's see our new About Us page. I'm going to come back here and I'm going to refresh. And as you'll notice, uh, this URL no longer exists. It's taking us to our 404 page. Okay, so this doesn't exist because if you remember, we changed our URL to Magento Store or About Us. About hyphen us. So now that we did that, we can see all the edits that we made, including this uh, hello text that we added and our recently viewed um, products here. Let's go back to our, our template actually. Let's check something out show files okay so this template isn't inside of this three column set i actually don't know if this would obey the laws of the three column set as it is you might need to use your um powers of css to make this look nice in here yeah see this sort of just messes it up but as you can see the content is in there using this uh this widget so of course 
you can input this however you want. I don't know why you'd want to do this on the about page anyways. However, um, for some reason, if you felt so inclined, um, you could do that and it would be all good. Let's refresh this. And here is our about page, okay? So you could put images, you can put text, you can um, change the columns here, any of this stuff, and it's all gonna be good, okay? So the same thing goes with um, this privacy policy page. It's just another template right here. Uh, where is it at? Privacy policy is right here. Um, here it is. And it's the same thing for the home page. So if we just click this home page, go to content, you can see here's the images. Here's the, uh, it's grabbing the popular, um, the, I think, let's see, what's, what's it actually grabbing on the home page? Um, the best selling products. So this is the template right here best selling products. Here we are. Um, all this stuff, and this is how you edit it, okay? So these are the CMS pages in Magento. You can also create your own CMS page. We're gonna go over that later. It's not really needed right now. Uh, and that's that's how you create or edit the pages that are already existing here, the homepage about us, any of that stuff, okay? So if you have any questions, uh, you know, feel free to leave a, leave a comment in the comments below or hit us up at Twitter, Level Up Tuts. Once again, this is Scott, and thanks for watching. Bye.